Hello and welcome, this is the next Blender tutorial about modeling some stairs for our room. In this tutorial I'm going to show you some tricks like using the array modifier for creating the steps and we will start by adding a cube that represents one step of the stairs. First I will scale this and then I will apply the scale and then I use snapping to snap it to this wall here. Then I will select the room in object mode and press the H key to hide the room so that I have a free side to my step model and then I switch to edit mode for this and delete all the faces that won't be visible. Okay, now press delete, faces and the faces will be removed. Then I press Alt H to show the room model again. And then I will add an array modifier to this step model to multiply this model and set the offset in C and Y direction. Okay. One time for C axis and one time for the Y axis. And now you can increase the count of these steps to build your stairs. Here we go. Okay, I think I will increase the height of the first step and for we added the array modifier it will be applied to the other steps as well. Okay, just pull it upwards Okay, then back to object mode bring it to a position like here and increase the count of the steps, just till it fits the height of the ceiling. And now we can again work with snapping, hold the control key pressed while you are moving the model towards the wall till it snaps. Okay, that's fine. Now let's add two edge loops to extrude out a wall on the right side of the stairs. Again, snap this one here to the stairs, add the second one and then switch to face selection mode, select all these faces here and press E to extrude out the wall. And snap the end of the wall to the first step of the stairs. Okay, looks nice. Now press Shift F to change to the fly mode and move around in this room by using the WASD keys. Alright, I like the geometry, but we changed it and therefore the UV layout isn't correct anymore and we have to reapply this. So here's a cool trick. I will switch to the material tab select this gray material and press select and now all these gray faces are selected and I press H to hide them and now I switch to the top view press the B key and I can select all the faces of the first room with the material and the UV layout for the wallpaper then I select one face and made it the active face and press U, follow active quads and press OK. And the UV layout should be fixed now. Again change to the fly mode, press Shift F and fly 
through this room. And this looks decent again. Very nice. Okay, how about rendering this? Let's find a nice position for the camera. Okay, and then I will press F12 to render this and I will fasten this up. My graphic card isn't that fast. Okay, that looks good. Now let's apply the modifier for the stairs, the array modifier. And then I'm going to add a separate material for the stairs before I join them with the room to one model. Select both models and press Ctrl J to join them. And now we are ready to export the model selected. Press File, Export, FBX and find the directory of our Unity 5 project. And here it is in Unity. Start the game and walk around in this room with the FPS player. Very good. So as you can see, the room is growing more and more. And in the next tutorial, I'm going to improve the architecture of the second floor. So I hope you liked this video and my channel. If you do, please hit that like button and subscribe. Thanks a lot for watching and come back soon to JNL.